Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel and welcome back to Every Course in Myrtle Beach, episode four at Founders Club in Pauly's Island. We are on to the back nine here. We are plus three, 39, making the turn. Hope y'all enjoy the back nine. Number 10 here, par five, does go left. And as you can see, probably not a driver. We're gonna hit another iron. That'll do. Second shot, number 10 here, par five. We've got 245. Now, if you didn't watch the front, it is cold out, so we're gonna take some extra club here, go with a cut through. Kind of ballooned in the air. It's probably still short, but that was a good shot. All right, we're in a good spot here in two. See if we can hit a good pitch up there, get the second birdie of the day, and get this back nine started well. A little farther left on the rollout than we wanted. Gonna have to make the putt. Ah, man. Putter is hurting today. I'm gonna go down for fun to the other side, hit a pitch. If I can use this bank and get it up and down, I think that's worth a subscribe. Subscribe. Number 11 here, Founders Club, 160 yard par three. Was the site of my second and most recent hole in one nine years ago. That was a 187 six iron. Let's see if we can, uh, it's probably actually a six iron today as well from 160 into the wind. See if we can put a good one up there. Lag putt, see if we can get a par. All right, back right of the green, actually. You know, 40, 50 feet. Need to get our putter warmed up here. Be a big par. All right, needed that comebacker. Classic example of the waste area design here at Founders Club. You can drive your cart left of this green, get right next to the green, or on the right side's more waste area, kind of lining left and right of both holes. It's a fun course. Number 12 here, 490 par five. One of the most picturesque holes on the course, double fairway. There's pot bunkers in the middle, so my strategy is usually just aim up the middle and hope we don't hit it dead straight. We're gonna hit our first and probably only driver of the day. Let's put a good swing on it. Unfortunately, that was a good hit, but it was dead straight, so it might be in a pot bunker or a crazy side hill lie. Might have accidentally predicted that. We are in this pot bunker here, so. And near the lip, all we got is a lob wedge blasted out like 20 yards. Sucks. All right, 50 yards, so we got uh, probably a wedge opportunity there. Hundred 
123 yards actual yardage code I'm bumping up to 128 uphill a little bit 133 uh, into the wind a little bit it's 140 it's gonna take every bit of a pitching wedge oh and I hooked it hooked it hooked it this screen left that's bad really bad Picturesque par 5, number 12. Not what you want, fourth shot on a reachable par 5. I have to land it in the fringe. Nice par there. Number 13 here. Dog leg left, 350 yards from the white. Highly recommend something less than driver. We're actually gonna hit to like five or six iron. Yeah, so it looks like it's only 210 yards through the fairway. We got six iron in hands. Can't say I hit that on many par 4 tee boxes. Hundred and thirty-eight yards, little help in the wind, pitching wedge in hand again. See if we can make a better swing than the last. Not really. It caught green, but not close. Pars are always good. Four straight pars to start the back. 14, 400 yards from the whites. Difficult par four. Bends to the right uphill. Second shot. I think we're going to go with another two iron. Let's go. Kind of want to hug the right side here shortens it a bit and there's a little speed slot down slope so see if we can do that should be good 119 uphill but downwind so i think those are going to cancel each other out we're going to hit a gap winch god that's right of the group It's just really freaking bad. All right, not in an easy spot. Let's see if we can uh, get a little flop shot dialed in. I just hate that we put ourselves in this situation to have to grind for par when we're 120 yards out. But nonetheless, we are here. Let's make the most of it and uh, get this thing down. I had that going right, didn't go right, obviously. First bogey of the back. Plus four for the round, see if we can finish well. Tees are pretty far forward here on 15. The flags over that mound. I'm a little PO'd after that bogey, so I think I'm a sin driver. See if we can get a good little uh, chip uh, 30 yards or so in. Yes, I was hit good on a good line. Go, baby. Oh, no. I hit a little tree. I guess it needed to be a few feet farther left. Hopefully it kicked straight down. Hit a limb. All right, we're on. I'll take it. Kind of a scary shot. All right, 
Good par from that sandy lie over there. All right, we are on to 16, quaint little par three here, 117 yards. Let's see if we can stick a dart in there with pitching wedge. I think it goes without saying I'd be rather be a lot closer than this, but uh, see if we can have good speed and maybe get a tap in par. Pulled that. Pulled it, pulled it. Came back at the end. Uh, some would take that as a gimme, but we're gonna, we put everything out. It's like two and a half feet. All right, good two put. We've made it to 17, par four, about 430 from the whites. Pretty tough hole. Uh, Ben's left up there towards the the greens that way. There is um, waste area that cuts across. So we're gonna hit three wood, see if we can place it out there in a good spot. Yep, that'll play. 149 approach here. We're kind of in a little pocket where the wind just died, so we're gonna hit real quick. Got a nine iron. Be right. Looks close from here. Let's go. Never mind, not close, but uh, we got an outside shot for birdie here. Thought surely that would turn some left. Okay, good par on this hole. One to go. Final hole, episode four of every course in Myrtle Beach from Founders Club. We got a 340 par four. Once again, not a driver. There is uh, water that cuts across, so uh, it's gonna either be a four or five iron. We'll see in a sec. Yeah, sir, we're gonna go with the five iron, make sure we don't flirt with that water at all. Just a touch, touch chunky, but should be out there pretty good. All right, approach shot here to 18, 135. We got a nine iron. Not what we wanted, obviously. We did hit that tree, stay up. I caught it real thin, not a good shot. So to stay up, I guess it could be worse. We got a tough Y here, downhill Y. Not making it easy here on the last hole. Flew the green, man. Don't want the only double on 18 here. Come on now, gotta get that up and down. We're back there in the bunker, kind of botching this hole. Come on now. I'd say that was really good from an awkward downhill side hill stance. Let's make this putt. All right, good putt. That's a uh, 78 here at Founders Club in Pauley's Island. We are signing off. See you in the next one.